Hi, this is Far Starter, and this is a review of the SH Figures Kamen Rider Agito Ground Form in Shinko Joseo. So this is the packaging, just a run through of what it looks like in uh, all four corners, and then at the back we have some poses of Kamen Rider Agito. And let's open the box so I can tell you more about the figure. Agito Ground Form coming into the SH Trigar Shinko Choseo line is not the most exciting release for the said premium edition but there are things to be said and why this should be picked up. Updates aside from the body type, the gem on the chest is now more transparent making the details inside more prominent. Next is the Ultra Ring or Agito's Henshin Belt is now closer to your DX Belt should you have one and it is more accurate at that. It is inclusive of just 6 interchangeable hands and his additional awakened cross horns. This additional head is not that different when replacing this on the figure and it is just a quick pop and swap though I like this more than the default head so I kept the awakening head version um, because I like it better than the uh, non awakening version upper thigh swivel right here double jointed knees and ankle joint and a toe joint and you can see the foot markings or the the details underneath the foot so other than that there is an additional joint on the upper torso so you can uh, pull this one up so you can bend agito all the way forward and all the way back so it does help on the articulation on this area so some of the details right here have been a great upgraded since this is Shinko Joseo so like the jewel right here it has cool uh, details inside so it's a clear plastic and then you can see uh, the sum of the details you wouldn't see on the first edition so even even the belt right here looks like a D a smaller version of the DX so uh, some of the details here of Agito on both sides of the belt and then you can see the different jewels inside and it's a great great figure um, despite that it does have lackluster on the accessories I wish it could have included some effect parts but um, I'm happy what it is and I think you should pick this one up if you want to complete the uh, Shinko Choseo uh, Kamen Rider line so there's not much on the set, but note that the first edition is way outdated to say the least. This will be a good entry to Agito if you pick this one up, as the details are more accurate. You will be fixated not on the figure, but on the transformation belt that is so accurate, it is so crispy. What is this review without downside? I only have a few. Since the set had little exchangeable parts, a good effect will be a better replacement and an upgrade from the first edition. When I was toying on the figure, the metallic paint seems to rub off on the waist. Not to be disturbed about, but it is something to be cautious of. And that is my review of the SH figure at Kamen Rider Agito Ground Form in Shinko Choseo line. If you want to know the possibilities for this figure, do check out the photos at the end of the video. And don't forget to like, share this video, and subscribe to this channel for more toy reviews.